So now we're on the Binotone 5 Star, which uh, I think is one of the best Sabinet 134 based radios going. And yet they fetch less money. I've seen them recently sell for £30. Roger, just about to say I'm ready, so that's fantastic, yep. Roger that, well I'm in position, so uh, start me off when you're ready. I'm ready now. Right, we're just setting off from Ancaster Service Station. Roger, got you loud and clear, Ancaster Service Station. So we've set off, started two thirds of a mile, no point coming back here. Right, we're now square wheeled at Ancaster Crossroads. Roger, got you at Ancaster Crossroads. Oh, you can tell these have got a bigger loudspeaker than normal, they certainly got that fuller sound. Roger, got you at the top of the hill. And we're 28 from Mississippi. We're now going around Grassy Corner, Wilford, over. Roger on that. I'm on a Binotone 5 star. And that is doing a full 4 watts, over. Yep, Roger that. All received. Roger, got you going over Willsford Level Crossing. Roger that. Right, we're now crossing the Kelby turn. Over. Roger, got you at the Kelby turn. Roger got you at the Grayleys turn. Now that's one of the best you're ever going to hear because the sensitivity was uh, 0.26 of a microvolt by the time we'd done for 12 decibel and 0.23 uh, microvolts for 10 decibel. We just don't normally see those kind of figures on any CV radio, whether it's ancient or modern. Roger, got you going over Rossby Level Crossing, also known as Greylees, and um, so that's it, thank you. Yep, no problem, 10 10. 10 Original factory mic, we'll do our test to the base station, which uses the same chassis. Don't think all Binotone 5 stars work as well as this, although they do all have the large speaker. This is exceptionally good, and um, you know, we do, you do see variation from anything as, as well, say we say as lowly as 0 0.7 microvolts to what we've got on this today, but this is the best one I've ever seen. This is the one where the high load power switch had been disconnected. Um, so anyway, that's all restored and I'm sure the customer will be very happy indeed to get that back. So we'll go over to our Harrier CBHQ base station and see what it sounds like on that factory original mic. Tango 21, testing the Binotone 5 Star into our Harrier CBHQ base station. It's a 1981 radio using the Cybernet 134 chassis. And this is with the factory original microphone. Testing one, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, 